What did you, what were you trying to do? I was gonna do? kiss you. Didn't know this fish Why was named Dougie. Hi! Oh, we gotta redo it again, that was stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> We're back! Guess what? Oh, Kelsey and Cody in the kitchen. This could only mean one thing. Well, Dessert. Yeah. And we're back for redemption. We're both embarrassed by our performance last time we did this. Uh -huh. And uh, it's time to prove mm -hmm. our abilities. Mm -hmm. Well, we've actually come a long way since then. Okay, so welcome to my video. So we have come back for redemption. Cody has come a long way since the last video. I think my skills have pretty much just kind of plateaued, but Cody it has become a very skilled baker. And so we have come to redeem ourselves by making, remember this old pal? The milk bar cookbook that we made from last time. We made the chocolate, nope, we made the cornflake chocolate chip marshmallow cookies. They didn't really turn out that way though, did they? No, they turned out like shit. Like marshmallow hard little pancakes, that's what yeah. they were. They look like fucking pizzas. <laughs> They're fucking huge. This but this time, we're gonna make the same thing, but instead of cornflake chocolate chips, we're gonna do fruity pebble marshmallow cookies. And we're taking this shit seriously this time, people. Mm -hmm. Because this is a redemption video, we, it wouldn't be right if we didn't have the same sponsors last time. Before we get started, a quick word from our sponsors. Take it away, Kelsey. Oh, hey, thanks, Kelsey. As Kelsey just mentioned, the sponsor of today's video is Thrive Market. So if you don't know, Thrive Market is an online membership-based market on a mission to make healthy living easy and affordable for everyone. Once you're a member, you get members-only prices, and members save an average of $32 on every order. They have the highest quality, healthy, and sustainable products. They have organic and essential groceries. They have clean beauty. They have safe supplements, plus ethical meats, sustainable seafood, clean wine, and more. Guys, it's healthy without the hassle. Yeah. If you're on a diet like keto or you're vegan, you basically can just go online, click vegan, and it just shows you all the vegan things right there. And to top it all off, it's delivered with carbon neutral shipping from their zero waste warehouses. I know I've mentioned Thrive before. I love it. I clearly get a lot of good, healthy snacks. This time I got zinc to keep me healthy. Um, and it's just, it's really just the best. So click the link in the description if you want to give Thrive Market a try. You can choose the membership model that best fits your lifestyle. They have one month and 12 month membership options. And there's a new offer. Join today to get 25% off your first order and a free gift. If you're deciding which membership to choose, I chose the 12 month because it comes down to like five bucks a month. But if you're not 100% sure you want to keep doing Thrive, you can choose whichever model works best for you. Thank you Thrive for sponsoring today's video and let's get back to baking. Take it away, Kels. Ouch. <laughs> Thanks, Kelsey. That stuff sure does look great. We are making the Fruity Pebble Marshmallow Cookies. Now, one step that we didn't do last time, we didn't make the Corn Flake Crunch. Is that what it's called? We didn't make that. Cody was like, no, 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 it doesn't matter. Turns out it did. So, this time, we made the Fruity Pebble Crunch. Here's a little B-roll. <laughs> There is me making it, and it uh, it looks amazing, and look now the, butter, the butter gone inside there, and I yummy. <laughs> I'm just I'm explain. I'm doing like a TikTok voiceover. Oh. So then we add a little bit of butter, and then we just put it in the oven for about 10 minutes. What you don't see <clears throat> in the B-roll is that we burnt the first batch, so we had to make it again. <laughs> But now it's good. These are gonna be mint this time. We're not skipping any steps. We're not mm -hmm. taking any shortcuts. No shorties. Time to cream. That's what it's called when you mix the butter and sugar together. Okay. Dookie. Two sticks. Two stickeroonies right here. Watch this. Okay, I actually like don't know why I thought that would be cool. <laughs> so you just, you just fart it in with that. We need one and one fourth cups of sugar. That's what that says, right? Sugar. One and one fourth cup. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. And then 
light brown sugar. Two thirds cup, tightly packed. Tightly packed. There we go. Well, you're packing. Thanks. <laughs> Medium high for two to three minutes. Got it. We're gonna add an egg and vanilla. I kind of messed it up a little bit because I didn't let the butter come to room temperature. So it's not really as creamy as it should be, but I think it'll be fine. The butter ended up warming up, so it actually is creaming quite nicely. Beautiful. Just taste it to see if it's good. Butter and sugar, but. Yeah, 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 it's good. That's good. Let me try. Oh yeah. my god, it's yeah. good. Okay, egg is in. I'm letting Cody take the reins because he's better at this than I am. This that's, is the new crunch. That's for the reference. first crunch that we made. This is the new one for reference. And this is the new one. Fucking beautiful, perfect. Beautiful and color. I was trying to convince Cody that the other one was fine, and that's why he's taking the reins on this process, and I'm not. Which is funny, because usually when things are burnt, you're sensitive to overcooking. I'm usually like, that's fine. <laughs> yes, but you're a baker. I'm just the baker's girlfriend. That's true. I guess this is my calling. Okay, vanilla's in. It says read about the process, right? Mm -hmm. I'm assuming that means like the, how, why you beat it for uh -huh. seven to eight minutes when the egg is in. So we're all clear. We didn't make that up. I remember last time you guys, you guys commenting being like, wow, seven to eight minutes, you idiots. We didn't make that number up. That's just Wait, what the what? recipe were, says. People were giving us heat for that? Yeah. Why? Because it's too long. We made those incredible brownies. That was also part of that process. Because they whip the egg so much, it gets so much air in there. Mm -hmm. And then it's like the dough, stand, or the batter, at least for the brownies, it stands up on its own because of the air, and so it doesn't get too like condensed and fudgy. It actually has some air in it. We'll check back in when this baby's all mixed up. And this, folks, is how it's done. It's that is fluffy. So fluffy and, and light. Oh my god, yes. Next up, we gotta mix the dry ingredients in, but we gotta be careful not to over mix it. It says, be careful not to over mix it, otherwise these cookies will suck major ass. I don't even know what to say to that. I'm scared, I'm losing steam. I'm just so defeated watching Cody bake and me being helpless. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, Kelsey's getting in the mix now. So the flour's in already, and now we're gonna do half a teaspoon of baking powder and a quarter teaspoon of baking soda. Let's go! Wow, I, I don't wanna brag, but I crushed that. Uh, Perfect so technique. One and one fourth teaspoon of salt. These are some salty dogs. One teaspoon. And then and you need one fourth, right? Now hit that bitch on low. We just want it to stir for basically one minute. Hey Siri, set a timer for 30 seconds. That's right! All right, turn it off. Turn it off, quick! Let's see if this works. Ah! Let's go! You guys, I really think we might have done something this time. I think we did it, Joe. Yeah, let's keep like some hefty chunks, or what do you think? Yeah, like this is too hefty, so I'm gonna just do one yeah. of these. So now we're putting the crunch into the cookies. And just we're gonna beat it, people, until it's incorporated. If you remember from last time, just until it's incorporated. All right, now stick it on low, just to get that first batch in. Okay, let's keep tossing it in. Yep. <laughs> That's why I turn it off. <laughs> I'm kind of scared, so I'm going to um, <laughs> take a little breather because I think I got shocked. She's got bitch slapped. <laughs> Is it possible to get like electric electric shock? You didn't get electric shock. It's plastic. It says on the back electric shock hazard. This is why I don't do this. Okay, we're just until it's incorporated, Joe. So we're gonna use one and a fourth cup of marshmallows. Look at this dough. Let me just, it's, hang on. The dough, if I could even, it's just like mm. heavenly. Oh my God. <laughs> it actually is so good. Yeah. Be careful. <laughs> I'm actually scared. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. I've been shocked before. I'm scared. Okay, now fourth cup. Just until incorporated. Say it. Just until incorporated. <laughs> Just until INC. <laughs> Hi, my name is Justin Till Incorporated. Nice to meet you. Justin Till Incorporated, like a company? Yeah. Oh, nice, yeah, <laughs> I like that. That's, that's so incorporated, I mean, come on. Yeah, they're incorporated. We might as well be making these in Delaware. This is so incorporated. What? <laughs> a lot of corporations are, are like from Delaware. <laughs> reasons or something, I don't really know. Okay, can I open this? Oh, look at this shit. Should I do this? Yeah. What you can do too is you can just grab something like this and then you just like, uh-huh, and put it right there. 
You guys, uh, to all my Joes out there, we <laughs> did it. And you better all be Joes if you're watching my channel. That's insane. We have to roll the shit into, dough, or into balls and then let it cool. Let's just chuck that bad boy in the freezer because it's easier. We're gonna freeze it and not refrigerate it, just speed up the process a little bit. Yeah, S of the P. Which is what screwed us over last time, but all right, dough is, dough is cooling, so yeah. we're gonna eat some food and clean up and we'll we'll catch up with you in about 30 minutes. Oh, and by the way, dough is cooling, we're gonna eat some food and we'll catch up with you in 30 minutes. Okay. This is my video. Right, your video, sorry. I'm just kidding. No, I'm not. Never do that again. <laughs> The, the dough is chilled AF. The dough is insanely chill. Little <laughs> nice. throwback to we'll Cody's throw little podcast. Only the real ones know. And now we're rolling it, and we're using this one third cup. That's what it says to do. We know that's massive. We're fully aware. Did Chili poop, by the way? Sorry, guys. No. All right, these, it's actually not, these aren't huge. How far apart does it say? Four inches yeah. each? I have no idea. That's about four inches, right? Like that? Are you joking? That's your dad's joke, babe. No, my dad's joke would say six inches. That's about what? No. Yeah. But no, because it's always smaller. You want it to be bigger. Well, I said four inches is this big, mm -hmm. which means that. Sorry, just a little brief intermission on us talking about <laughs> dick, fake dick size. Like, if this was four inches, then this would be eight inches. Which, that's what the joke is. It's like, it's like no, I'm, I'm, that's like about a foot, right? I'm about 12 inches long. Check this out. Oh, oops. No, that's not funny. That was a whole cookie. I yeah, know. that's <laughs> not funny at all. We're going We're to need another, another tray. tray. Oh, for cripes sake. Oh, for the love of cripes. Our fridge is just one giant balancing act. <laughs> you guys, this dough is insane. Oh, 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 oh. oh my God, he's so strong. Oh my god, this dough. I can't stop. I'm gonna get salmonella. Okay, so these pops are going in. Say bye bye, little guys. We'll see you Let's on see. the other side. Those look pretty solid. Eliza's on the other side. Yeah, my bobble's on the other side. Cut those suckers out. Quoting Hamilton. Set a timer. Hey Siri. Set a timer. Okay, you're really becoming my dad. <laughs> more more. Watch, watch, go. Hey Siri. Set a timer. Hey Siri, set a timer. Hey, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> hey Siri, set a timer for five minutes. You fucking bitch. How long are they supposed to go for? 18. But there's the thing with our we oven. We gotta check before we have, 15. We have the hottest oven in the world. For example, the the crackle that we burnt before. The crackle. The recipe said put it in for 20 minutes. We mm -hmm. put it in for 15 and it came out black. Mm -hmm. Brown. So we had to put it in for 10. It's 50% of the original time, so we're very careful. I burned everything I've You should I probably check these at 10 yeah, minutes probably. then. The thing is, it's like hard to tell when a cookie's done. Ah, uh, yes, the old cookie debacle. <laughs> See you in 15 minutes. Ah! Okay, well. Bad news. These, by far, are the hardest cookies to bake. In the world. Okay, okay, so let's just take a look. We, we did just... everything right. How long have they been in for? 10 minutes. 10 minutes they've been in for. Okay, and here they are. <laughs> Marshmallow pancakes. They're like, they're like black. This is black right here. They're like golden on the edges. <laughs> Raw on the inside. They look like scalloped potatoes. <laughs> Maybe part of the issue is that the marshmallows need to be cold in order not to melt like this. I don't know, I don't know, I don't fucking know. So Look at this. So we're gonna keep these in the, fri in the fridge for a while. Another 45 at least. Yeah. Well, about... here they are, I wasn't focusing before, but now you can really see how charred these suckers are. Charred on the edges and then just... <laughs> They're little potato pancakes. Some sour cream in the middle, some chives, they look delicious. This is sad to me, this was just smoking when we took it out of the... <laughs> Yeah. 10 minutes in this fucking thing. Okay, Cody is eating one of the bad cookies. It's not bad. They're actually, they're really good. They just need to be shaped better. Yeah, they are really good. Right? Yeah. The new baking sheet, the nice one. So I feel like we're gonna have some luck here. Okay. okay. Uh, good luck in there, sweeties. Even for like how bad, like hey, bad they are, they're good, you know? They're really good. Mm -hmm. All it needs is some shape. Yeah. I'm good. I want like a actual cookie though. A bite, you know? yeah. It feels like bark. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, you said bark, sorry. 
Oh. We might have done did it this time. Those look way better. These, better. these fucking. These things. look like actual cookies. Sort of. Sort they're of. Still kind of giant. They're a li well. They're gonna be giant because that's you know the size that they said to make them. But these actually look like cookies. These look like bowls. But we're getting somewhere for sure. Definitely better. I think we did it. I think we. I think at le we at least can say we got redemption. Yes. On the original time. And then I think next time we try again for the cornflake chocolate chip and leave them in the fridge for a long time yeah. and like do a full yeah. 360. So this one is Dinner with Kelsey the Redemption episode. The next one is gonna be Dinner with Kelsey the full 360 episode. I meant dessert with Kelsey and Cody. I feel just so, so terrible right now. Your tummy? Yeah. Kind of pancakes again. <laughs> what the fuck are we doing wrong? Okay, let's try it at least. It's still good. <laughs> and I'm stick so to our tired. Stuff. I don't want to eat this anymore. I hate it. This is supposed to be like a fun, quick video, and it's just been three and a half hours of failure. <laughs> At least the first video, we knew we were gonna fail. Yeah. What's sad about this one is that we were like confident. We did everything we could. This one's so much more embarrassing than the last one. Like we legitimately tried. Last time we like didn't really try. I'm throw up for this. Yeah. I think I'm definitely going to. All right, guys. We're fucking tired. By far the best cookie dough I've ever had in my entire life. Oh yeah. Like the dough. And the cookies taste like the dough, which you know makes sense. But we're gonna go um, just lay face down on the couch. <laughs> Okay. That's water, not beer. Thanks for coming on this journey with us. We'll see you in a few months when we attempt to make these cookies again. <laughs> Please let us know what we did wrong. I need to know. But nicely. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, I don't... Nice. Well, you guys didn't consider that. Exactly. If your name is Josh Wiseman, then let us know what we did wrong. Thank if, you. If it's not, then zip it. Zip it. <laughs> okay. Love you guys. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Weekly vlogs start next week. <laughs>